Hey, it's me, Wilke the Cry here, and just earlier today I logged into my Facebook Ads account and I noticed that I got access to the Facebook multi-product ads, as you can see right here. So this means that inside one Facebook ad we can have multiple products and every single product links out to, to its own uh, landing page, to its own URL. So right now, like I said, it's just been released today. Right now I don't have any uh, split tests or any conversion numbers or anything like that. But usually when something like this happens, uh, it's best to jump on board as fast as possible because uh, people are not, like, they, don't, they haven't seen this ad as much as uh, other ads, as the usual ads. So chances are your click-through rate will actually be better than your usual ad. So um, what, I, what I suggest is to start, start setting up uh, these kind of ads right away if you have multiple products to show for it. For example, if you've got multiple t-shirts to sell in the same niche, multiple colors, try it out and see whether it works if you uh, link them all uh, with several images, several products. Uh, to your uh, in your uh, in your Facebook Ads account. So what I'm going to do right now is just head over to uh, my Facebook Power Editor. So you'll need to head over to facebook.com/ads/manage/powereditor because that's the only place where you can set it up. And I'm going to show you exactly how to set it up. It's real simple. So the first thing that you'll need to do, obviously, is create a campaign. And what's important that your objective should be either clicks to website or website conversions. It, the feature only works for these two. So I'm going to go to clicks for website. I'm going to ads. I'm going to create an ad. I'm going to add it here. So create a new ad set. Test ad set. Um, Multi-product test. I'm just going to show you how it works. Like I said, it's, it's really easy. Um, so first thing you'll do is just select a Facebook page. And here you'll see the option. Uh, just below create ad, you'll see single image and link ad in one ad, which is uh, what we've been used to. Or you can use this, the multiple images and links in one ad. So we're going to select that. And now you'll have a main text, which will be on top of the image, of all the three images. And here you'll be able to add one, two, and three separate, uh, separate products. So let's say the first product it would be um, let's say emarkey.net, just as an example, we can have, we have a headline, we got a description, and you can add an upload, an, an image. So once again, just for demonstration purposes, going to confirm. So this means, and of course the image should be 600 by 600 pixels uh, for best, so it's actually a rectangular image. So if you would do that, uh, you can, you'll have multiple images, and like I said, you can have uh, for each of your products, or if you have a shirt, for each of the colors of your shirt, you can add them as separate pr products with sev separate links right here. So this is one product here, I can enter a second one, etc., etc. So that's basically all there is to it. You can even have a see more URL if you add that then this will be added at the final step. So after all the products, so let me just, oops, go to the right. Let me just, if I go to the right, then the very last step, you see, see more at the market.net. So that's the last step if you want to add that. So that's it. It's real simple to set up. And I definitely suggest if you're running Facebook ads to set it up today, uh, because the faster you, you tap into this, uh, the higher the chances that you'll have uh, success with it and a higher click through rate. So um, if you have any, any thoughts, any, any creative strategies or anything else, let me know in the comments below. I'd appreciate that and I'll talk to you all later. Thank you.